Hey. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel, you guys. Um, today I have a video, and I hope you can hear me. I just don't want to talk so loud because, you know, other people are living in the building. And, but I do have a full bag of empties and things that I like and dislike. So hopefully this video will not be too long. And I'm hoping I'm looking right in the camera like I should be. I think I'm supposed to be looking over here, if I'm not mistaken. But we will jump into this video. Ah, number one, one thing is the hemp oil with the Omegas, totally empty. Um, they were soft gel capsules, which I love. Hemp oil is really, really good. This is a good staple of mine. Helps you rest and all that good stuff. I'll go into details and stuff with other stuff later. I just don't want this video to be too long, of course. So, yeah, this is really good. Another thing, chaga. Um, if you guys have not known about chaga, um, it is very good as well. Um, it's, it supports immunity. Uh, it takes the place of coffee. Uh, gives you energy. Um, it does a whole nine of things. It's good, like, for us brown people, for our melanin. So, um, yeah, it protects our melanin. Like, the radiation and whatnot from our body protects all of that. And, yes, I, it is gone. And I use mine um, as, like, a tea, hot drink. And it's so good. Oh, my goodness. Your body literally craves for it. It's a mushroom, so really good. Favorite empty, one of my favorites. Another one, and of course these two are in the same company, of course. And it's called the Harmony Drop CBD. Uh, really, really good. The medicinal, medicinal kind, and this is hemp as well, but it's the hemp extract. Oh my gosh, I'm telling you, I would not lie. When I come on here, I've been wanting to advertise this for a while. So, so, so good. When you're tired and you can't rest and you need some peace and you need the edge off of you, this is it. This is medicinal. It's not the kind that will get you high. Um, the dosages are not too high. I even give it to my son when he needs it, and it just helps him relax. And I mean, we're talking about sleep, because when you have trouble sleeping, it's not a good thing. But it's sleep causes you to sleep like a baby. And I mean, just just rest. Just chill out and cool out and just rest. So this is really good. It's called the Harmony Drops. Very, very good. You know, I gotta go back and get me these things because they're my favorites. I'm gonna take this one out again. This this here I advertised um, and reviewed on my other channel. I do have another channel, but I've been trying to keep this one worked up as much as I can because I, I have more godly things on this channel more than anything. But I want to, you know, since more people are on this channel already, I'd rather go ahead and put my nutritional product because I am a nutritional fanatic. So, yeah. Um, but this is the Goalie Gummies, and they're a very good product, Super Gummies. I had been having trouble with, um, sagging and all that stuff, uh, because of, you know, age difference. And this has been treating me very, very well. I love it. It's a gummy. And it's, it has collagen in it, so the collagen is what I've been needing. And, of course, it's the non-GMO and gluten-free and all that good stuff. So, these are the kind of things I get that does not have all those different extra things in them. So yeah, that's one of my staples. I love it. It is empty. This is another Palmer's uh, Raw Shea Butter, butter Balm. It's really good. I use it on a lot of things. I use it on my skin. I've used it on my hair. Um, still just not moisturizing enough for me because I had been going through products like I don't know what for moisturization and I had been having a hard time trying to uh, find something that would really, really moisturize my skin. So, um, this was doing pretty well, but um, not the best, but I love it. I still like it a lot. And I did get this from Walmart, of course. This is another thing. Um, I did stop taking this, but I love it. It's gummies, and it's uh, very, very good. I left it off to two that was left in there, but I definitely don't um, use them anymore. I eat them anymore. Um, they are somewhat sweet and sugary, but they were very, very good for my bones. Very good. I would have no more aching. I would have no more stiffness. 
my fingers would get kind of feeling um, weird and puffy and swollen. And when I take these Caltrade Bone Health, they were so good. Very, very good. So anyone my age, 40 and older, um, should try this. It's the highest level instead of vitamin D. And it's really, really good. I got this from Walmart as well. Tastes good too. So moving on. Vitamin D3, one of my favorites again, especially with this um, this brand, which is a Diva brand. And it is vegan, 25 and 1,000 IU. But these are really, really good. Vitamin D and it's empty. Of course, I haven't gotten any more of them. I have to get some more. But they work very, very well. Vitamin D3 is a must for your, your body. You don't even really have to have the calcium a lot of times. But this here is they call it the sun vitamin it's very very good for your skin and your immune um it just does a whole lot just research the thing but diva is the thing the tiniest peel like ever form i don't have um i don't have a, um, an example in here for you but it's the tiniest peel so that's why i get the diva vitamins because they're much easier to swallow i don't like uh, peels but these are very good because they they're very very tiny i mean tiny tiny peel you can take it and you swallow it easily. That's one of my favorites. Um, these are iron. I don't like them. Blah. Thumbs down. Um, it says Doctor's Finest. I uh, iron with vitamin C, and that's the reason why I got it as well, because uh, it helps it absorb the iron with the B12 in it. But I don't like it at all because when I started taking it, and it's a great flavor, but they're really really sugary and they look like this. Um, purple like color and um, they were, feel like they were literally constricting my, my vessels in my chest area so and it made me really feel bad so I don't I don't care too much for these at all so no this is cool and they're going in the trash this here I just picked up from one day from Dollar Tree I tried on my hair hair most styles and controls I didn't like it it was a thumbs down for me as well so still kind of full but I'm getting rid of it trash for me and this i used to use back in the day rave the rave products so they were very very good for my hair if you guys can't tell i have funny hair i don't really have brown people's hair i have like a mixture of hair type so um of course i do have some mixtures in me of course you know, if you look at me you may can tell that i don't know but um this i can't really tell whether it works or not uh, I'm not too crazy over it, but some of the other products of Rave I used to love. But this here is a holding spray, supposedly. And it says extra strong hold, but doesn't do too much for me. So, going in the trash. Sorry, Dollar Tree. How I love Dollar Tree, though. Okay, this is another one, the hair junk. Now, I used to, well, I still do. I used to come with the two different, it's banana kind or something like that. It smells like banana. This is it hair gel ultimate hold so they say but when I tried it I did not like it at all it's, let me see the smell again or the smell smells heavily and it's and it's uh as you can see it looks like banana and it smells like banana oh my gosh I hate to give this up and throw it away but I love the smell but it doesn't do anything for my hair it just doesn't so I was gonna in different strokes though for different folks too so just because it didn't do anything for my hair doesn't mean it's not going to do something for someone else's, but oh my gosh, this smells so good. I can't eat it. It smells like banana pudding. It smells so good, but it's gone. It's a gone for me. All right, so the Toms, hmm. I always use the paraben-free type of uh, deodorant. I used to use Toms, and Toms would never bother me. It was perfect at one time, but I started using it, I guess, because our bodies go through changes, and I think it's because it's lime. And someone had given me this, and I think it might be just too strong for me. It smells really good, but yeah, very, very good. It smells just like lime, citrus. You can smell it, but uh, I don't think I'm going to put this away. I think I'm going to give this to someone. But um, yeah, it didn't work for me. It was just literally too strong, and it literally started making my underarms, you know, sore. So, so next thing is herb, herbal Irish moss. Now, I love Irish moss. I have a, a video on here. It's uh, 3 point something K um, on here. And it did very well. But it was the Irish moss that was the raw kind that you had to blend and mix up yourself. 
um, this here what peels. And I ordered this back a while back ago. My video's about to cut off, y'all. So if it cut off, I'm gonna have to re um, finish it all over again. Um, I had to literally, they're capsules, of course. And I think they're gel capsules, I'm not mistaken. But it did not work for me when I first took these. Uh, and I took them kind of slow, but um, I had such a problem with these. They were making me lose weight like crazy. So, I mean, you know, if anybody want to try these, um, I wouldn't say that it wouldn't work for anyone else, but they just didn't work for me. They had me falling off and losing weight like mad. So, as you can see, I don't need to lose weight, of course. Um, if anything, I need to gain it. But, yeah, Irish Moss is very, very good. Very, very good for your hair, immune system, everything. The whole nine, I love it. Uh, but this just wasn't right for me and then I could be just allergic to it as well so the black elderberry is what I take all the time but I have liquid kind that I got from CVS so I will be sharing that with you as well um, at the time when I couldn't find the perfect kind I, I resorted to the pill form which I don't like I don't like pills at all like I said because of the size of it but this is how they look and I just don't like them. I feel that they, they don't really do anything, I guess, because they are in the pill form, and I don't really like that. Um, it's capsules. And um, I won't be using these because I don't like them. I even try to do them using them in a, in a tea form, and that's mostly what I do a lot of times with things. Um, I drink them <laughs> because they're much easier for me to do, right? So they don't work for me, though. Blackberry, oh, black elderberry, but I do use the black elderberry, but just not that kind. And this, like I made a video before, was is my very best friend, the Fenty Greek. And this Spring Valley brand, I guess it's pretty good. I like the noun brands of everything. But, um, yes, this is my number one product, and I love this. Um, I'll go into detail again with that, but it's very good for either like premenopause or, or older people, or even when you. PMSing or having your periods, it slacks the periods up and stops it and puts everything in a balance and a tone. So yeah, this is really good as well. This here I got from, I think I got this from Walmart of course, but this here is called Pink Luster and it was a, a balm, like a hair smooth uh, edges, like, of course it's gone, it's empty. This was one of my favorites. I'm, one of my favorites and I picked it up that time at Food Line. And that was really, really good. I like that. So good. It worked for my edges pretty well. You can see I have, like, stubborn edges because um, my hair is so shabby. So. so I have a few more products in here. If you're not trying to make this video too long, can too. And I, this was one of, time, one of those times when I was trying to find another um, good um, edge control, which is before I, before I got this one. This one, of course, is the best, the better one. And the can too. Um, it did okay for a good while. I did, and um, I just stopped using. It. I didn't get any more of it after that. But it's still, you can still see some more in there. I was trying to keep it before I really threw it away. It smells really good though. And then the Airborne Elderberry. Love them. They were so good. They were uh, gummies as well. Uh, but some of these things were so sweet. And I guess that's why they say that gummies are not really good for you because of the sugar. Even though there's there are pectin in it. Um, and this was um, vitamin C and like the zinc in it, naturally flavored. But it's really good, the airborne kind. I got this from Walmart as well, so. But it's empty, but it's a good empty. And this here I got from Dollar Tree, Softy Mango. Uh, mango never really agreed with my scalp. For some reason, it would give me headaches. But this here, I just put it on the top of my hair, and it was very moisturizing. It smells very, very good, like it's edible. Of course it's not. Don't try to eat it. But this is from Dollar Tree. Very good empty. And vitamin D2. I don't know what happened. I thought I used could you do vitamin uh, D2, but it seemed like this here, for some apparent reason, it doesn't work for me. The vitamin D3 is best, and that's D1 as well, but these didn't, they're still full. They, and they're tiny. This is just like this type of size. I want to show you that the Diva vitamins are. This is how small they are. Very small, very swallowable, very tolerable. I love it. That's why I always choose those pills. They're pills, and 
or their line of pills, and they work very well for me. I love them. I just wish that they get a vitamin, uh, one of them whole vitamins in a pill form that's small and tiny like that. But they have them bigger, and I seem like I just won't choose that, even with the biotumors. And this, of course, the up four was my son's at one time. The prebiotics, pro probiotics, and plus prebiotics, they were gummies. And I think they work pretty good for him. He loved them. So I got these on Amazon, of course. And simple goodness. I think they're more natural, gluten-free, and all that good stuff. That's the kind of things I try to stick with. So that was pretty good. And this here. Okay, I'll let you do this one first. The Diva. Because my light is blinking again on this phone. The Diva, this was the iron. This is the kind, the chelated kind that I can take that is non-constipating. And they're, they're real tiny pills, just like the ones I just showed you from Diva. A very, very good. I love these. These are my staple. Big time. These are the only things that I use. They're so good. They work really well for me. Because um, at one time I was anemic and, you know, this is what I use. And they really work well. They My, my uh, levels came up to normal like it's supposed to. So, you know, these are the ones I continue to take. And last but not least... Um, I, when I was ordering these, I had these in mind, they're like pure cricket powder. Um, I do know in the Bible they say that we can, you know, we could eat these type of things, right? But when I got it, I didn't realize they were powder form. And then when I read it, it said something about allergens. So I know you have to be careful with this type of thing, it says, with the crickets. I thought maybe it was make, I think like maybe a full cricket to eat it. I think I would prefer it to have been better than that. But it says it's a superfood. And... This is the site, I think, right here on here. I got it. And it's never been open. I would hate to really even throw it away. Um, but it's old now. Anyway, it says 20. So, yeah. I'm sorry, though, about that. I do have to throw that away. But, yeah, these are all my empties, you guys, on the bed. majority of them. And um, I hope you enjoyed this video because it was about time that I was able to get this video out.